all of my kings are just in there you know let's enjoy the kings 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 hi everybody welcome back to my channel this is a tongue today i'm just gonna do a quick video for you guys and this is just gonna be a quick video because sometimes i don't do like a big tutorial because i'm busy with baby so i'm just trying to find something to just make it easy for me to go but anyways before i go and just show you guys what i'm going to quickly show you guys uh, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to turn on your notification. There's a no uh, there's a bell just next to the subscribe button and yeah join the family We're growing hair together. My son is in the back today <laughs> He's just being a little bit nice and I'm trying to Mom is just trying to get her things done. Anyways, he's all good and fat But anyways, I'm gonna quickly go into the video and just show you guys what I'm doing today It's gonna be a quick video. Usually some time I try to create like a nice afro, but it doesn't work So the first step I'm gonna do is put any oil of your choice in oil of your choice I'm gonna use my hair lotion I'm using pink hair lotion because my hair is almost gonna be washed and I don't want to use my really nice oil because my hair is gonna be washed soon I've told you guys before if you're gonna wash your hair soon try not to use one of your most expensive oil because don't know you don't want to have expensive oil in your head and then it's like washed away what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some of it then go bomb there you go just wait for mama that much so you do this in the shower so what I'm gonna do is I put this oil onto my hair so I just dub it in dub it in dub it in dub 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 like that and right now it's creating right now you're just creating that pulling and pulling so what I want to do is I want to have a little bit more, you know, a little bit of definition to my uh, strands here. They're just not really much, not definition, but I mean like volume and a bit of shrinkage. So you can have that really nice round afro. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump into my shower. And then as I shower, the steam is just going to, you know, work around this thing. So I'm going to come back and show you guys. I'm going to come back and show you guys how it looks like. So let me just jump into the shower. Anyways, I'm out of the shower. And this is how my hair looks like so there's a little bit more definition not really definition with my 4c and i just use my hands to pull it to create more volume i mean to create more volume so my hair now is kind of soft so basically you're kind of reducing the spraying of water and it's going to take a while don't worry it's my kitchen area and i just because it's steamy in there so i don't want to say in there so basically this is what i do and then i just keep pulling so basically what you're doing is styling it the way you want I want a little bit more volume in the front and on the side just to give me that big afro look and yeah so you can see when I put it on the oil was white and everything but look at it now it's it, the heat the steam kind of put it in so yeah this is how it looked like uh, I'm gonna try to get ready for the day so this is it I'm gonna see and then I'm not going anywhere so I'm home so this is the style that I kind of been wearing for the last one week. Oh, come on, look at my afro, guys. So this is how I want a little bit more volume. I'm going to go ahead and just kind of like, you know, work around this and just see what I want. And I'll come back and show you guys the final result. Not really the final result. This is how it's going to look like. But I'm just going to go touch up a little bit, check on my baby. He's crying. Feed him and I'll just show you, you know, lady needs to look a little bit put together, you know. Okay, I want to quickly do that. Anyways, I'm just done with uh, my hair. My son is in the background making his own noise. I just went ahead and touched up a little bit, a little bit of makeup. You know, I'm home, but <laughs> girl, gonna look good. So yeah, this is how I do this. So you can, I'm just gonna be at home. So I'm going to just, you know, do mommy duties. Yeah. Anyway, so this is how I actually achieve this afro. I've been having a lot of people questioning. This is how I achieve this type of afro. And basically just quick in the shower, get some steam going, you know. So after it's out of the shower, you try to minimize touching because your hair is really like, it's gonna, you know, crease more and all that stuff. But yeah, this is about it. I'm just gonna turn so you guys can see. yeah and yeah there's a lot of shrinking there's a lot of undefinition but that's okay just have this afro rocking i always don't have a perfect afro but this one 
this is how perfect I can get not really perfect but this is how it is all of my kings I just in there you know let's enjoy the kings 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 kings, kings. anyways guys this is how I achieve this really quick afro look I've been enjoying these afro looks for the last one week and I love them you know anyway don't worry about my jackets making so much noise but this is yeah i'm gonna be actually staying home hope you guys enjoy this video give it a thumbs up let me know if you like this video and just let me know how do you achieve your actual afro and how do you style your afro looks i've been loving this i don't even know if i want to go back i don't know if i want to do more afro puff now that i have this afro looking like this so yeah i think i enjoy i love it guys Ooh, okay <laughs> Hey, hey. Oh, my son is grabbing the tripod. Anyways, guys, I gotta go. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you. Bye-bye.